The city has reached a temporary agreement with the management company for the climbing wall at the Long Lines Family Recreation Center. The agreement with White Water was to expire at the end of this month, one year after it started. Under the temporary agreement approved by the council tonight, White Water will continue to receive an $8,333 monthly management fee from the city, plus an additional $50,000 for facility upgrades and marketing. Whitewater will retain all revenue from the operation and management of the facility while a long-term management agreement is negotiated. Mayor Bob Scott says he's hopeful a cost-effective agreement can be reached. Well, hopefully there will be an agreement of, in principle that will reduce the city subsidy but yet maintain that, that uh, facility for people to use. So hopefully in the next three months we can come to some sort of agreement that will work for everybody. A GoFundMe has been created by Alex Irwin, who's the manager of the climbing wall. He's looking to match the city's contribution of $50,000. Now in the post on GoFundMe, it says the funding agreement has changed. So we are asking for your assistance to keep the gym running in its current public form. And it continues on to say we will need to raise $50,000 to match the city's contribution.